Uh, Matt, uh, that was a tough game today. Um, you must be pretty happy to come out with the result you wanted. Yeah, it was a tough game, as expected. Leeds always bring uh, an element of physicality to every game they play in. But, yeah, delighted to get over the line. I thought the players um, showed a lot of character at the end. Defensively outstanding, and our discipline just got us over the line. So, yeah, dead chuff for, uh, for the boys. Yeah, definitely. Like, over the moon with the win. Couldn't have asked anything more on my debuts for a team win. I'd like to have been performed slightly better than myself, but I'll take a win every day of the week. As you said, not to underestimate Leeds, they really did come to play rugby, solid in defence and, um, and their set piece seemed to work very well for them. Yeah, it did. We started very well and um, I think we a couple of little errors by us gave them a little bit of confidence, which gave them a foothold into the game, but um, we didn't underestimate whatever team uh, Leeds bring. As I said, they're a force in the championship and they've got a strong uh, strong squad, so uh, again, just, just pleased to get over the line at the end. We said that we, it's going to take 60, 70 minutes to break them down and it showed towards the end that we finally got the rewards for playing. We came out to play from minute one and that's what we're going to do all season, just batter teams. We seem to start the, the game, especially in the first half, with all the possession, with all the momentum. To go in at half-time, uh, three points down, must have been slightly frustrating for you. It, it was frustrating, yeah. The, the message to the players there was almost try not to get too frustrating. What happens then is uh, they kind of look at the scoreboard and try and force the game, so you saw at the back end of uh, the first half, little errors start to creep on our game, offsides, knock-ons, because we were getting frustrated. So the message was uh, to keep doing what we were doing and trust in our, you know, trust in our systems. And uh, I didn't, I didn't want it to take as long as it took, but it did get us over the line eventually. Definitely yes, but you know there's things to work on. We're a new back line. It was the first time we've all come together. We only had two training sessions this week. We just need to be a bit more clinical in the 22, and we'll start to reap the rewards. As you said, eventually we, we got there, and in terms of self-belief and uh, playing to the final whistle, um, Bristol showed they had that in them today. Yeah, they did, and real pleasingly as well, obviously, we had a number of uh, boys on debut, so Carpenter, uh, Augie Slovic, uh, Joe Joyce, Sammy, young boys, we want them to have a winning experience in a Bristol shirt, so for them to, uh, to get over the line at the end, it's special having a debut in a Bristol shirt, they're all Bristol boys, but it's extra special when you uh, seal it with a win and you know, we want the men to be uh, a tough place to come and our young players are going to be key for that in the future. At half time we said just get a bit more patience, be a bit more clinical and, and we would see the rewards and towards the end of the game we started to break leads down and we started to sense it. We, we picked our body language up, we picked up the tempo and uh, and the end of it, we managed to do it. From a back's perspective, it wasn't very conducive weather um, for running rugby today, but we did see glimpses, didn't we, of Sammy Speed, um, Slowick doing what they do best and really putting on the burners and showing their speed. Yeah, they did, and that was their message before the game, is go out and do what you're, do what you're good at, go out and express yourself. And I thought Augie in particular made some really good breaks in the uh, first half, just unfortunate we couldn't get anyone on the, uh, on the end of it, but he's a young player and he'll, uh, he'll take a lot of learning from this experience. Yeah, I definitely woke up this morning Looked out the window, I was praying for it to be dry. But, you know, I'm happy with uh, the way us, us back three performed under the conditions. Ultimately, though, regardless of competition, four wins in a row now, building momentum, building confidence, the team are looking in good shape. Um, everything looks pretty positive. Yeah, it is positive. It's a positive group of players. I think it was important to, uh, to get the result here because, you know, we've got a big squad and it's important that we've got a winning mentality throughout the squad. So. Yeah, it's a, it's a positive place to be and I'm sure we'll try and work on a few, uh, few things this week, but you know, it'll be a positive, uh, a positive week.